The Port of Savannah is seeing the most activity since the start of the pandemic, breaking a record for the number of ships coming through in 2021. That was just one of the messages coming out of the annual State of the Port address today. In tonight's economic impact report, WSAB's Brian Ray is on your side with the plan to bring in even more business. We are now the hub port for the Southeast. We're the gateway port and the choice, first choice for customers coming to the Southeast. 5.6 million containers came through the port last year, a 20% increase from the year before and surpassing the three other port cities in the Southeast. That activity continues to climb into the first month of the new year, up 4% compared to 2021. This is just an exciting time to think about all these investments paid off. The governor says he's pleased with the progress, which has been essential in Georgia's economic rebound throughout the pandemic. I'm proud of the can-do spirit that sets our ports apart from the rest of the nation. The mindset and approach is why there's no backlog of cargo ships waiting off our shores. But at one point, ships were waiting months to be unloaded, prompting officials to open pop-up container yards to help move things along. Now, I will be honest, we ran out of space at a certain point in time because of the sheer inflow, and we had 30 ships at anchor. But because of the projects that we put in place years ago, we were able to get ahead of it again. But Lynch says the work isn't done here. Today, he announced plans to increase the port's capacity by 60% over the next three years. That includes a new berth to accommodate up to seven big ships set to be completed next June. In Savannah, Brian Ray, WSAV News 3, on your side. Another project wrapping up is the Savannah Harbor expansion. It will allow larger vessels to carry heavier loads through the river. It's been in the works since the 90s and is set to be complete next month.